what is up YouTube today we got a very special opening a really cool set called legendary collection one it comes with the god cards and it comes with um, blue eyes dark magician and red eyes for uh, Yugi Joey Kaiba got a cool play mat and some really old packs so this is quite strange for back in the day because they reprinted some packs that were you know if this if this set didn't come out these packs would be worth a lot more than they are right now it, it, it kind of gives people a loss in faith for Konami in general because um, even though it's cool for like collectors and stuff it really it, it's gonna decrease the value on a lot of these cards um, because you know they're just like reprinting packs that haven't been available in years but yeah this is a cool set nonetheless um, here's the packs that you get with it the first pack ever LOB then you got Metal Raiders, which is one of my favorite sets of all time. Uh, then Magic Ruler, but they, it's called Spell Ruler now for like legal reasons, I believe. And then another one of my favorite sets, Pharaoh Servant. Let's pull a Jinzo from this set. And um, they skipped a few sets like LO, Labyrinth, Legacy of Darkness, Labyrinth of Nightmare, um, Magician's Force. But these are some good packs too. IOC, Invasion of Chaos, and Dark Crisis. Then we get a promo pack and a cool playmat. Let's look at the playmat real quick, and then we're going to get to the opening of the packs. And um, we're going to be opening a box of each of these sets uh, soon after this. I have a lot of videos planned for the future. So, as you can see, we got the Yugi Joey Kaiba side. That's actually really cool. That's a cool side. This is like a cardboard playmat, though. It's like it's going to slide all over the table and stuff, but it's got cool artwork. Shout out uh, B Skull. So shout out Joey, my favorite character. Got a random Democ on here. Um, and the God card, so that's a cool play map. Let's get into the promo pack real quick. Now we're going to open these uh, oldest to newest. I can't remember if Dark Crisis came out before Invasion of Chaos. I think it did. I actually can't remember. Uh-oh. Okay, so sweet stuff. We got the obelisk with the blue back. This is the one without the effect. Slifer with the red back. And Ra with the yellow back and then we got the blue eyes dark magician red eyes sweet stuff my favorite of the three is red eyes but um this artwork isn't too special i don't like any of the artworks i guess dark magician has the coolest out of these three artworks all right so as you can see here we got the sleeves and the ps in the card savers for psa unless we get something and if we get something um valuable for them to send in to them Excuse me in my bad English. All right, so let's start off with the best set. Actually, we'll save IOC for last because that's like everyone's favorite, but we'll start off with Dark Crisis. How about that? Let's get into this Dark Crisis. We want like Vampire Lord. Skill Drain is a good rare. Guardian Kayest. Kanye West. Sakuretsu Armor. Man, this card was so good back in the day. Precious Cards from Beyond. I've been playing since the start of Yu-Gi-Oh, so this is bringing back a lot of memories. Shout out magic cards, not spell cards. Contract with the Abyss, that's a boring card. Ooh, contract, wait. Oh yeah, you don't get a foil too. Contract with Exodia. So, too bad we didn't get Exodia Necros. Zolga. Hey, 1700 attack was pretty big back then. Ojama Green, I'm pretty sure Ojamas are good for some reason right now. Don't know why. Don't really follow competitive Yu-Gi-Oh anymore. So our best pull from that pack was Contract with Exodia. That's probably like less than a dollar. All right, Pharaoh Servant. Probably my favorite set of all time, if not Magic Ruler. I mean, if not Metal Raiders, but um, the set is sweet. It has some big beat sticks like Goblin Attack Force, and it had um, Dust Tornado. Just a lot of cool cards. But we're obviously, we're hoping for a Jinzo in this pack. So Armor Glass. Numinous Healer, Gift from Mystical Elf, Ground Collapse, that was a cool card. You could lock your opponent out of Monster Zones. Hayabusa Knight, I actually loved this card back in the day. I used to play a deck with a whole bunch of equip spells, and you equip them to Hayabusa and attack twice. It's like they're double potent because he gets two attacks. But yeah, not a good pack. Soul of the Forgotten, uh, Driving Snow, Bombardment Beetle, and Earthshaker. So another not-so-great pack, but um, still got four more. 
Spell Ruler next. This is my least favorite set, but it has some really good cards in it, like MST. It had some Tune cards. That's what we want. It had Upstart Goblin, so that's a good start right away. Got the SRL Upstart Goblin. Tyrone. Shout out Tyrone. Rising Air Current. These cards, I believe, are short print. All the, all the field spells from the set, so short print, maybe. Snake Fang. Hyo Ryu. Don't ask me how to say that. Hyo Ryu. Cool looking card. Dark Zebra. Gotta pay the troll toll. Fire Kraken. And a Gaia Power. Increase the attack of... Okay, maybe this they're not short print because I got two of them. I got Gaia Power and Rising Air Card. So I guess they're not short print. I don't know. Alright, we got... These three sweet packs left. Actually, my least favorite pack here is LOB, but probably going to save that for after Metal Raiders. I don't care about anything here. I just want a Time Wizard because Time Wizard is my favorite card from this set aside from... Well, I guess we could get Thousand Dragon too because that is my favorite card from the set, but Time Wizard is sweet too. Anything Joey is cool. Crest Clown. Water Omotics. Armored Zombie. Little Swordsman of Ale. I think the rare is next. Let's let's add some suspense. Launcher Spider. Mystic Lamp. Battle Steer. All right, did I mess up? Nope, I didn't. Pump King. What's the last card? Elegant Egotist. Lame. All right, two packs left. We still got nothing. I'm not the best pulls. L-O-B. What do we want from this? We want a Red Eyes. Alright. Root Warrior. There's nothing special in the commons in this set. Alright, I think that's four in, so let's go backwards. I don't even know if I'm doing this right, but... Um, Dark World Thorns. Flame Manipulator. I think you make Flame Swordsman with this guy, so... Shut up, Flame Swordsman. Sparks. Want to play Burn Deck? Alright, we already saw this card's Petite Dragon, so... Junk. Alright, if we don't get a Dark Magician of Chaos, Black Luster Soldier, Envoy of the Beginning, Chaos Emperor Dragon, Envoy of the End, if we don't get any of those, we are upset. I'll even take a Dimension Fusion. Alright, so since we know the trick now, think okay actually I don't know the trick we're just gonna go straight through this come okay uh, nothing too great but I'll take it manicore of darkness okay sweet and this didn't happen back in the day if you got an ultra you would not get a rare I'm almost positive on that um, but I guess they just had to adapt to the new way of packs, you know, with a rare and a hollow. And we got a Manju, so that was a really good pack compared to everything else that was really junk. Um, so, anyway, let's get this video to 100 likes. If you hit that number, I'm going to get started on um, recording 24 packs of each of these six sets. It's a booster, pack, a booster box worth of packs. Um, they all came from the Legendary Collection, so... And, uh, so yeah, thanks for watching, guys. If you've got any ideas for future things you want to see on my channel... Um, Leave it in the comments below. I'll make sure to read all the comments. And uh, give it a like. And uh, subscribe. I'm going to be making a lot more videos from now on. So, peace.